hello everyone welcome back to my channel Khaja cooks and today i will be making for you banana fritters of my subscribers saw the potato fritter recipe now the other day and they asked me to please make for them my banana fritter recipe so let's get started okay so yeah i've got two bananas that i mashed up in my bowl already okay Okay, now I'm going to add one egg. One egg in there. See, it's very quick. Okay. Okay, now a tablespoon of melted butter that goes in the bowl. A tablespoon of sugar. Just a tablespoon because bananas are sweet. A tablespoon of sugar. of salt just a pinch a tablespoon of vanilla essence I'm just gonna eyeball it as you all know already that's how I do it <laughs> this will drop I can see already how much I want okay and just mix that again Okay, now the flour. Just move this a bit so. I'll add it so a cup and a half of cake flour. Eh? Just cake flour. That goes. And another half. Of baking powder. Hey, this is not this, this is a tablespoon. <laughs> tablespoon <of powder. laughs> Teaspoon of baking powder. Okay. And your half a cup of milk. Ne? And you just mix that through. smell the vanilla and the banana these fritters were far my favorite fritters and it is my daddy's favorite <laughs> okay how quick was that now guys it like just took minutes to make that ne? minutes two minutes three minutes and now we're just gonna fry it ne? okay so i'm gonna fry a few for you basically the same like any other frit you just switch on your pan, medium to high heat, and cover the base of the pan with some oil. Not a lot. And let that just lick a heat up. So here I've got my cinnamon sugar ready to throw on top. Because it doesn't take long to fry. Yeah? So here's my batter. I let it rest in the fridge so for 5 to 10 minutes, but you don't have to. I just did it 
because I was told to do that when I was taught how to make it <laughs> by my late mom. I'm just following suit, but I have already in the past not done it. And I would be in a hurry and just fry it just so. <laughs> okay, you can just feel if this heat is, the pan is ready to fry some. Feels hot, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so this don't take long to fry now, as you can see here, uh, it's turning brown already. You just flip it over. And give the other side another few seconds and that's how quick it goes just keep the plate ready here and your sugar cinnamon sugar to dust on top guys if you can smell the flavor yo it's just amazing <laughs> the banana and the vanilla essence just filling up my whole house here the whole How's he smelling like it? <laughs> you know, and this you can make any time of the year. It doesn't have to just be in the month of Ramadan. If you list for a nice sweet treat, put this together quick, quick, and it will be so liquor. Okay, I think this one can come out. You see, golden brown on both sides. On the quick finish there. Okay. Now in goes our next batch. And so you just continue, ne? You can place on four or five this in your pan depending on how big your pan is or as many as you like okay. whatever can fit in your pan <laughs> now while this is so hot I'm gonna throw on my cinnamon sugar both sides okay So if you're in a hurry, this is the perfect thing to make. You see the baking powder is letting it puff up nicely. And then you just continue and finish the rest off. And what I found out about this fritters, they are actually easy to store. You can fry it in the morning. If you feel maybe on a weekend you want to finish your stuff up, stuff up early, you can fry it in the morning, put it in an airtight container and, and put it away in the fridge or wherever. And you can just warm it up slightly again when it's booker time. Yeah? Oh, cookie time. Okay, so yum, yum, good. Yeah, quick that wind now. And on with the cinnamon sugar. And I'll fry the rest of off camera. Ne? And I'll just off pack it. <laughs> we'll put the others away. And can store well in the fridge. Say, for instance, you made too many, and you can put it away in the fridge and take it out the next day and just stir it up a bit. If it needs a little bit more flour, you can add a little bit more. Ne? 
Okay, I hope you enjoyed this recipe as much as I did. Banana fritters, quick, quick. And I'll see you next time, inshallah. And Jumma Mubarak to everyone. And have a blessed weekend.